Each airport in the national airspace system has unique and distinct characteristics, which can sometimes lead pilots to use the wrong surface in taxi, takeoff, or landing operations. Let's take a look at some of these tricky areas. From the flight deck, Dane County Regional Truax Field is a large multi-use airport located on the north side of the city of Madison, Wisconsin. The airport serves air carriers, military, cargo, business, and general aviation. The pilot experience level goes from the basic new student all the way to seasoned air carrier or military pilots. This mix of pilot experience and aircraft performance makes Dane County a challenging airport for controllers and pilots. The configuration consists of three intersecting runways, 1836, 1432, and 321. A complex system of taxiways provides access to facilities and businesses located on the east, west, and south side of the airport. One of the unique issues found at Dane County has to do with the surrounding topography. Aircraft arriving from the northeast and northwest have sometimes misidentified runways 18 and 21. Pilots are reminded that landing runway numbers and aircraft heading should be the same when on final. Loading an approach to your landing runway could help avoid this error. Pilots should be alert to the fact that transiting the airport from runway 1836 to the east side facilities requires at least two runway crossings. This is especially true on Taxiway Charlie. Unauthorized runway crossings have earned this area a hotspot designation. Keep in mind, you do need a specific clearance to cross any runway, active or not. At three nine, back, cross runway two, one, turn right, tax, wait, Recent construction projects have attempted to reduce these occurrences. An example of this would be the new taxiway Mike 3, located opposite taxiway Charlie, across runway 1432. This is a part of a larger project to extend taxiway Mike to the approach ends of runways 18 and 14. Another area that warrants additional attention from pilots is designated Hotspot 1. Although recent mitigation strategies and special emphasis from the tower have reduced the instances of wrong surface operations, it is still a complex and possibly confusing intersection of two runways and a taxiway. Use of moving maps or reviewing the airport diagram will help alleviate this situation. Pilots need to remember that if they are ever in doubt or unsure of any instruction or aircraft position, the easiest answer is to ask the tower. They are there to help. Being aware of the hotspots and other configuration issues at Dane County Regional Airport will help pilots make better decisions and along with the ATC tower, keep the operations safe and efficient. Now, you're better prepared for your trip to Dane County Regional Truax Field. It's always better to know before you go.